All right, down on the field, post game with Mustangs head coach Ed Hoddle. Coach, you guys win it today, 38 to 9. Couldn't have asked for a much better start. No, it's nice to, to get out of the gate fast, and, and the guys did a nice job. And, you know, you know, we talk about special teams all the time, and that's a big special teams play to start, forcing the fumble, and then, you know, getting seven points on the next play is, is, is huge. And, you know, we were able to, to maintain the momentum throughout the afternoon, which I thought was really, really key for us. You know, we've struggled when we've jumped out really, really fast on people. Um, we, you know, we've struggled to finish, and it was nice to see our guys finish today. Uh, you had a big play at the beginning of the game last week against Frostburg. What helped you guys, as you said, uh, maintain the momentum this week? Well, the emphasis all week in practice has been finish. You know, we, we, we haven't finished a lot of things that we've done to this point in the season as far as, um, you know, just in-game and practice. And, we, we, you know, we went to the drawing board this week and really evaluated everything that we do and, you know, kept coming up with we've got to be able to, you know, maintain momentum by finishing plays and just doing our job. And the guys did a nice job this week. Uh, the defense uh, did a very good job keeping points off the board. Zach May had that big play. Uh, how excited was everybody to start a new interception streak? Uh, you, you know, the streaks are for you guys. You know, it's nice to, you know, to, to get back to turning the ball over because we know that, how key that can be, and, you know, now and, and, and as we move throughout the season. And, you know, one of my last reminders to the guys, you know, every Saturday is take care of the football and take the football away. Um, so it's nice to, to get back on the plus side of the, uh, of the turnovers. One thing that's always been tough for, uh, for the defense to stop has been a mobile quarterback. Did you guys do something? Because it didn't seem like Whitehead really tried to run, and, and he's always been a runner. He ran last year. He ran last week. Was there any kind of emphasis on, on keeping him limited uh, running the football? Yeah, we, we, we worked hard all week to keep him in the pocket. Um, you know, we, we adjusted some of our practice drills, you know, as far as, um, you know, working to contain a mobile quarterback. Um, and we know that's kind of been our Achilles heel a little bit. And, you know, Coach Johnson and Coach Nelson did a great job getting the guys ready for that. And, you know, and the guys did a great job in practice understanding what we need to do and bringing that emphasis, you know, to game time. Coach, how did you think uh, the quarterback and the you know the big three receiver uh, trio looked? Ellison and Addo and Salisbury, and what is it like for you to, for the first time in seven years, have the starting quarterback back and, and all your top receivers back? It's the first time you've had that kind of continuity year to year. Well, it, that, that's key. You, you know, you, you look at the numbers. I think you know we threw for over 300 uh, today, and you know that that's a key is that continuity and those guys, and it's exciting for me and. Um, you know, those guys work a tr tremendous amount throughout the year together. You know, it could be, you know, 100 degrees out here, and you look out the window, and there they are. It's, you know, it's in the middle of the winter time. They're out there working. So, um, you know, they do a great job working together. They, you know, three of them live together. So, you know, they're around each other all the time, and, and it shows in their play on Saturdays. Coach, what are you guys uh, looking forward to this week at FDU Florham? Uh, you know, for us, it's it's looking forward to, uh, you know, watching the film tomorrow, getting with the guys on Monday, uh, and cleaning up our mistakes. You know, for us, again, it's 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 looking at what we can do to be be a better football team, you know, over the next, you know, seven days. So, for us, it's it, the exciting part for me is I think this football team has a, has, has a great amount of growth yet to do this year. And, um, you know, it's going to be a process, and I'm, I'm excited. I know they are for, for the, the challenge. All right, Coach, congratulations on the win today. Thank you very much. That was Mustangs head coach Ed Hoddle Stevenson beats Kings for the fourth straight time, 38-9. to